they fix that all up. Let's take the time to invest in something. All garbage, but now look at it now. Look at that reconstruction. They're about to redo this whole entire house. And it's probably gonna be worth it. Some people are fixing up their homes. They know what's going on. But for the most part, it's this blighted, blighted neighborhood. Like I'm in the Mac and Bewick area right now. This is Garland and Charlevoix, I believe, area. And look at this, they like just rebuilding some homes. And you taking it for a joke? Get out of here. <laughs> you taking it for a joke? You think they messing around? No. They about to sell it to you or rent it to you. Look what this futuristic house look like in Detroit. Can I shrink that down? There we go. It's a box. Look at that, beautiful. Right in the, in the middle of the neighborhood. It's another one. glass in the back. Look at this right here. Rebuilding it. Brand new home. Just redoing the whole entire thing. garbage that you don't want, somebody else see a value. Now this one is on sale and I actually seen it online. So you have to like take a look at that one online and I'll see if I can try to link it to my uh, page. It's a beautiful home. Let's see, that's the real estate broker, I think, right there. Read the number. Hopefully you guys can read the number there, the real estate broker. Beautiful home here in Detroit. My whole point of the video is to just to make you aware of what's going on in the city. And that's probably in any city, any urban city. I don't really concern myself if you buy something or not. Just want to make you aware of what's going on and make you realize because I hear a lot of times people are misleading others to think that they have garbage in their neighborhood like the houses the whole neighborhood is just trash when you are being fed something in your mind you know somebody can influence you that easily to think that 
your neighborhood is garbage and you will sell out to go somewhere else different thinking that you have something way better in a more expensive neighborhood. But then when you eventually try to come back and realize that you you were sitting on a pot of gold, you can't come back because you can't even afford it. I have one house that I've been um, following and I seen that they, it, it was actually listed. I'm gonna see if I can link it in my bio or some, some sort of way linking it on my page and you can actually take a look in the inside of it. The real estate broker is uh, selling that particular house and you'll see the price on it. I'm not gonna say it right here or now, but you'll see the price and you'll have a better understanding of what's going on. All right, guys, I'm X-Ray Grace from Detroit and I will talk to you guys later. I'm out.